Hello, this is R-I-C-K-Y, the YouTube tech guy. Hey guys, so today we are bringing you how to transfer everything from your old phone to your Huawei Mate 10 Pro. Now, this looks like it should be able to be done with an Android or iOS. It's basically a QR code that you scan on the new Mate 10 Pro and this will allow us to help transfer everything and we'll see how well it transfers. So I'm gonna put this as the new phone and I'm transferring from an Android. And then you have to download the phone cloner uh, by again, scanning the QR code, which we'll do that now with here. So let's go ahead and do that with the Pixel phone. I can just bring up Google Lens and it should be able to scan. And there you go. And now we're installing. And if you want, of course, you can just download the app itself. I'm gonna make sure while it's downloading that it's the same way for iOS. So yes, it's the same way for iOS. You just download the phone clone app. Oops. And now we're gonna open it on this phone, agree. We're gonna say this is the old phone because it detects that it's not a Huawei device. And now we're going to allow everything. And now it's going to scan this QR code. As soon as it comes up, there you go. And now they're connecting directly to each other. Now this is happening through something called Wi-Fi Direct, basically. And so it's going to take my 8.4 gigs and transfer it over. Now you can see on here, it does tell you this should take about 45 minutes. In my experience, these are generally always longer estimates uh, just to be on the safe side. But regardless, you do want to make sure you have enough uh, battery life on these to really do that and then go ahead and just transfer and then it's going to get started so as you can see it originally says the estimated time of 54 minutes as soon as it starts transferring we'll see uh if that changes yeah so whoa okay so the main thing you need to know when doing this transfer is that your Mate 10 Pro has to already have your SIM card in it. So if you're transferring from an old phone to a new phone, put the SIM card in first or else it will not work. And that's how I figured it out. So just know that that's the biggest thing you need to know is that from your old phone, it, uh, if you have only one SIM card, it needs to be in the new phone already. You cannot have your SIM card in this phone and, and just wait. I was gonna just put the SIM card in after it transferred, but I had to put it in before and it works fine now. So that's the biggest thing. And as you can see, it has already gone down dramatically. So when I said it wouldn't probably be like 45 or 50 minutes, it's already down to 25 minutes. My guess is it'll be 20 minutes at most uh, when it's all said and done, but you can see that it just transfers over everything nice and easy. So this is really good for a transfer app, text messages, call log, photos, audio, video, document, system apps, and, or system data and apps. I like it. Um, I, it's not the most complete one I've seen, but it definitely is better than some that I've seen. So that is how you transfer everything over from your old Android or iOS device to your new Mate 10 Pro. Hopefully you guys liked this video. If you did, please give a like, thumbs up down below. This has been R-I-C-K-A-Y, the YouTube tech guy. Thank you for watching our video. If you liked it, why don't you go ahead and subscribe up there. Make sure you follow us on social media right here. And of course, check out our latest video up there. And right down here, you're gonna find the perfect video for you. Or at least that's what YouTube tells me. Thanks again.